This tutorial is for using Office 365 online. Log in to Office 365 by accessing the Great Falls Public Schools website, selecting Parents and Students, and then Online Resources. Click on the link for Office 365. Remember that as a student, your username is your first name, dot last name, dot graduation year, at gfps.k12.mt.us. Your password will be identical to the one used at school to log into a computer, Moodle, or Google Drive. Once you are logged in, you can access your one terabyte of cloud-based storage in OneDrive, or begin to create a Word document, Excel spreadsheet, PowerPoint presentation, or OneNote notebook online. Sites are online SharePoints that we are not currently using. To begin working online, simply click the button to begin working online for the application you wish to use. The application will load in a new tab. There are limited options when working online, but you have most of your font options under the Home tab. Under the Insert tab, there are options to insert pictures from your personal files, or to search online pictures. While working online, the document will sync or save automatically to your one terabyte of storage space in OneDrive. However, if you want to save the document in a location other than your OneDrive, click File, Save As, and you have two options, one to download a copy to your computer or download a PDF of the document you are working on. Also similar to Google Drive, there is a Share button in the top right which allows others to view and or edit the same document you've created. You also have the option to work in the full desktop version of each application. Once you are logged into Office 365 and have begun an application, there is a button on the right side of the ribbon that says Open In. Clicking on that button will load the desktop version, allowing full functionality. A dialog box may pop up asking if you want to open the file. Click Yes. Then a yellow ribbon will appear at the top indicating it is in a protected view. Click Enable Editing. As long as you began with signing into Office 365, when work is complete on the desktop version and you click Save, it will sync with your OneDrive, allowing you to access it from different locations such as school or home. If you want to work on an existing document already in your OneDrive, click the application OneDrive, and then click on the document you wish to edit. In order to begin editing, you must click Edit Document on the left side of the ribbon and select which option you want to use, Edit in Word or Edit in Word Online. Then you can begin working on the document. To navigate back to Office 365 and other applications online, click on the top left icon with the dotted square. This will give you access to your OneDrive and online applications. To log out, you need to click on your name at the top of the document towards the left side of the screen. Then your name on the top right corner has a drop-down menu and you can select Sign Out. This concludes the Office 365 online tutorial.